like any any other uh, kill streaks, you basically use squad points to unlock whatever you want to get, uh, weapon attachments and perks and everything. Uh, one thing to keep in mind is that you can unlock a perk even though you're not what is it uh, the rank uh, even though you don't have the proper rank to get it you can unlock it which is uh, something to keep in mind because you can unlock something and you think that you'll have it available and you won't I almost fell into that trap but luckily I didn't insta kills are still a really big problem in this game I'm gonna put that on connection uh, connectivity Hopefully, next gen won't have to worry about that with them going to the dedicated servers. Who knows? Uh, but I've I've noticed that there is either going to be uh, somebody's going to have like a really big lead, and the other team is going to get smashed, or it's going to be the other way around. And I've seen that happen a lot of times in this game, and. It, it all comes down to the connection. Uh, Insta kill goes hand in hand with lag, and it seems like somebody's always getting screwed in this game. One team is always going to get screwed. Very rarely have I been in a match with a uh, an even tight match. You know, it's either been a blowout, whether I'm winning with a blowout or we lose by a blowout, we get blown out. So. Um, uh, again, I don't know whether that's it's like that for everybody, but it's definitely that way for me. Other than that, uh, I think those are just the the issues that I've noticed so far. Uh, the game just came out, so you know they they're always they're gonna have updates and uh, firmware updates to try to fix this, uh, fix these issues. Because I'm pretty sure I'm not the only person that's having these types of problems in the game. Uh, but you know it's just something to deal with it's another Call of Duty game I don't think Infinity Ward or Treyarch is ever gonna put out a well polished game so you have to take the good with the bad when you're dealing with these games uh, but I, I will say that even though it does have these problems I do and I am enjoying the game so far so far I'm enjoying this game uh, I think this game is much better now because Treyarch really dropped the ball with Black Ops 2 in my opinion they just put out a product that was that's still not finished and it's been out for about a year if not a year uh, you know so uh, that's just what it is hmm let's see damn it Yes. Oh my goodness. See, and this is what I'm talking about. This is why I don't like snipers in these games. Look at that guy. What are you doing? How are you helping your team by just sitting on the roof waiting camping? You're basically just camping. That's why I said in Call of Duty, just have a a section just for campers. Have a game mode just for campers. And that's it. I mean, you 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 gotta have they kill the flow in my opinion I can understand I'm sitting up here just capping a flag and and then somebody just comes up and sprays me like what just happened but that other guy was just laying down chilling probably just doing it for kill streaks I don't know Ooh, I like that I don't understand this SATCOM how it works I put the SATCOM down and it rarely ever like shows people it's weird Hold on, I see this guy over here. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna get him. Get him. Where'd he go? Oh, there, there he is. Right. I, I, man, maybe the satcom is like more of a, an area thing. See, look at that guy. I mean, that was like basically an insta kill, and unless he got shot by somebody else, like I literally shot that dude once and he died, and then it seems like that guy shot me once and I died. So. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe I'm going to be proven wrong here, and we're going to have a pretty solid match. Maybe, maybe. I think it's more dependent, because this game mode is more dependent on the, um, 
who, you know, whoever captures the flags, the most flags, and holds them for the longest time. I don't know. But if you play like a kill, if I if I play kill confirmed, for instance, or team deathmatch, or one of those game modes, it's either we're blowing out the other team or we're getting blown out by their team. It's never been a down to the wire finish. So maybe some of the guys on Xbox, some of you guys on Xbox or PC can shed some light on this, or even PS3. Maybe it's just you know my connection or something. I don't know. I'm not using Wi-Fi. I'm using the uh, the cable straight hooked up to the PS3. So hmm. ah whatever. I got shots on that guy, so I'm not gonna complain about that. Oh, I need to go back over here and get that. Where is it? Yes. Uh-oh. Somebody's coming around. How did he see me? Yeah. They see that guy right there. It takes so much skill because he's trying to, you, you know, he's trying to quick scope. But as far as I know, quick scoping has been pretty much taken out of this game. So... You know, they, they have a whole collection of Call of Duty games for people like that. You want a quick scope? Take it to another game. Because it's going to be really difficult and hard to do it in this game. I do like the fact that it seems like this game is more towards gun-on-gun -gun battles. Uh, as opposed to, let's just get the biggest kill streak, Which I like. Because this is, in fact, a shooter game yeah you know, first person shooter so for them to put more focus on the gun battles is um is uh is a good thing good idea for me because I don't always get high kill streaks uh, but I am fairly decent with a gun in my hand I'm a very dangerous man now I'm not gonna say that but pretty cool so far like I said just those issues are that they, they, they aren't gonna like make or break this game but they are something to that that I felt as though I needed to tell you guys about and see whether you guys are having the same issues that I'm having hopefully everybody is having a good time playing this game and isn't and isn't uh, being lagged on too much while the insta kill is still there and you still have lag this and that I haven't had any repeat bad lag like it had been in previous Call of Duty games and I haven't seen a host migration so uh, I don't know whether that's a good thing or bad see that right there I don't like I feel as though that guy should have died but you know whatever I got hit markers on him so that's like that's like a step above kind of the the way they changed the map is kind of weird too it's going to take a little while to get used to look at this guy man give it up dude that's so lame like that really gets underneath my skin infinity ward needs to do a better job of getting these games to where snipers are corralled like horses in in a pasture like here here's a here's a game mode just for people who want to use snipers sniper rifles call it sit around and shoot each other I used to call it search and destroy but they, they changed that so don't have to worry about that anymore when's this match over see this match isn't that bad actually so now I look like the guy that lied about blowing out teams are getting blown out that's great what are you doing bye Oh, and you had a nice little satcom there. Had a nice little satcom there. Was that the same guy? Ha! Nice. No, that was him. Never mind. Thought it was him. Do I have a satcom? Put my satcom right here. Oh, we're about to win. Is that the victory? I've raised my hand to victory. I've raised my hand to victory. It's over. Done. 200 to 188 Call of Duty Ghost on PS3 soon to be PS4 I'm not having it in the game caviar studios and I'm out